Just testing the stream. Test one, two, three.
All right, here we go. Gonna be playing a mission I've been playing for a while. It's from the Steam work Workshop called Immersive Alternative Start. And while this is loading, I can talk about it, I suppose. Um, it basically is a pretty cool start to it. Uh, you're in a, a ship that's uh, malfunctioning, um, and you get a little escape ship, I guess. Um, call it a starter ship, whatever. Um, and it's you could program it to head to one of three or four different start locations. Um, so I'm using it, uh, I picked a asteroid start location. Uh, so I've landed inside the asteroid and um, started building, trying to survive. First thing I did was get some uh, solar panels up to power uh, or just get some um, power stored in batteries or a battery um, and I put a medical facility there because my health was low and uh, if I didn't get some medical attention soon I won't be surviving so that's up and running I also found a rover actually a little uh, rover with drills on it so I can uh, mine a little bit Here's a little tour of my ship here. It's pretty basic, has an arc furnace and an assembler. Unfortunately, just an arc furnace, so I can't build much because I can, I can only refine. Uh, with an arc furnace, you could refine, I think, iron, cobalt, and something else. Just three basic materials. So you can only build basic blocks from that. Um, so yeah, right now I think I picked up a bunch of cobalt, so it's refining that. I'm not sure how I'm going to get rid of this stone. I wasn't able to get rid of it easily. So unfortunately I have a bunch of stone in this stupid, uh, taking up storage, but I'll solve that later. I did find some uranium, which I mined but I can't refine it, so that's of no use to me right now. So there's the arc furnace. I've got a ton of cobalt actually, but it's... I thought this thing was supposed to refine quick. It's pretty damn slow. I think the next order of business is going to be... I've got a little platform way out there. Um, it's going to be to allow this ship to dock and recharge its batteries, I suppose. Because otherwise we have no way of recharging batteries. So, let's go and investigate. I think there's a connector on the bottom of the ship. Probably use that to be able to extend the platform out there. And land, be able to land on it and connect up. Let's head out there and take a look. Let's check, make sure we have oxygen. We've got oxygen and hydrogen. Don't want to be stranded out there. Oh, here's a little rover I found. We've got it docked up right now. So it's a decent little mining rover. What's this down here? This was probably some of the stone I was able to dump out. Oh, it's all over the place. That's okay. I actually dumped it out from where I was mining way back. I think way back in here. Yeah, this is where I found the cobalt. I had to create a pretty big hole to get in here. And drilled most of this out. So I can get the rover in there. I didn't want to waste the rover energy or smash it. So there's a planet out there. 
let's go over to my platform. There's no sense in staying on this side. So here's my little platform. You know what? This is probably not even in the sun. Oh yeah, the sun's around that way. Actually, is it? Oh yeah, it should get the backside. Okay, that's good. So we got some decent power coming in. I, I do need to expand this uh, solar array. What's nice is I think the sun is going in an arc sort of around like this, so it pretty much will hit my my panels. We got some planets out there we can potentially get to. I did do some recon. We have some resources out there. I didn't know what it was because I didn't have a ore detector with me at the time. And some resources out there on two uh, other asteroids. All right. Let me check my battery status here. Yeah, so it's going to take a lot of time to recharge with it's going to take a full day to recharge this thing because I just have the one solar panel I gotta get some more solar panels up okay but first and foremost we're gonna build this structure I don't know how I want to build it yet maybe I should build this way flat there's a if I build out this way I can dock my ship this way I mean we don't have to carry about orientation it's not like there's gravity I don't want to build out and block the entrance although I guess there's a lot of room here let's check the rover actually I haven't moved this thing for a while, I do not want to waste power on the rover, so it's operating pretty much at minimal power. Well, right now it's, I guess, doing quite a bit because of the stupid, uh, um, what do you call it? The refinery. That's interesting, this looks like a... really examined underneath of this rover but that looks like a large landing gear not a small let's see if this will tell me landing gear that's got to be a large whereas I believe the ship is a small f I don't know it's hard to tell because I think a lot of this stuff is attached via connectors for some reason so I think they might have went from large and Put large and small ship together. Not quite sure. Okay, either way. What is this piece hanging down here? I guess just to protect. Ah, okay, that's cool. They protect uh, so you don't. Ah, that's a decent design. Blast doors, so you can't mash this uh, connector when you're trying to connect it to something. Those blast doors will protect it quite a bit. Actually, probably even rest of the ship what's under here oh, they use those blocks too that's a good idea so that way if the ship comes down hard you know when you're trying to land and stuff I'm not gonna demolish this is uh, my oxygen generator ah, interesting they used a curved conveyor and then attached hydrogen thrusters there I like that like that design all right so we're gonna I think build a platform here that sounds reasonable to me so let's see here they've changed a lot of things in this game so I haven't played it for a while. I don't know what the little plus means beside that, but... I 
This should build across here pretty nicely. Now, I'm not going to finish these blocks because I do not want to waste... Looks like I don't, don't even have steel plates. I'm going to need a bunch of steel plates. I don't want to waste materials, so I'm just going to... we can grab. Okay, let's grab as many as we can. We don't need, uh, probably don't need our gun here, but I haven't been close to being attacked by anything yet. But I'm still carrying the gun around. A little paranoid. Why can't I build there? smooth this out a bit. I want this a little wider. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know how wide I need. I need uh, probably a little more room here. So we're going to drill out. I probably don't care about this piece, but what the hell. Just enough so we can throw a block in here. Should allow me to put a block here. Oh, come. Ah, I just had to be pointing perfectly, I guess. Oops. Should have. Should have dug this out a little bit. Maybe I still can. Cool. I don't know how wide I want to go, but... What do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six wide. Sure, let's see if that's going to do it for now. Could always bring it out to 7 or 8 as we get further out here. Probably out of steel. Could turn off the antenna on that rover, save a bit of power, but I think I've got it turned down distance wise, so it's not really using a lot. Wonder if we should make some steel plates. Eh, I don't think we need to yet. Well, you know what? Not doing anything else with the iron. So my assembler, turn it on. Make a hundred steel plates. Looks like I could go a little wider here.
I already forgot. I really need to build underneath here. Or I, st I have to get the... How do I get power here? Do I just need a connector that goes nowhere? I think so. Well, that doesn't make sense. I need a connector to go somewhere in order to get the power off this grid. I may have to research that. Because usually connectors are not really connected to any... Well, you usually have your connectors connected to storage and crap like that. Um, but not necessarily connected to power. They just get power, I think. Hmm. Uh, the problem is I probably can't even make connectors. Not sure how I'm gonna do anything without a. Without a. Let's go back to the ship for a second. We're gonna need to think a little bit. Let's drop off. Problem is, can I even build connectors at the moment? I don't think so. Connector. I need silicon, which I don't have. Or do I? Here's the other problem with this game. The biggest problem with this game is the assembler will not look at stuff in cargo. So. You gotta almost pull... Actually, no. For assembly, I need ignits. But I could break down some of this crap in order to figure out what I need for... Yeah, so I'd have to look on the wiki to see, for example, if I break down a computer, will I get some silicon out of that? Most likely, of course. So, I could break down some of these computers to give me enough material to make a connector. Care about a spotlight. So I'm gonna need some connectors and then some conveyor tubes. Probably large conveyor tubes. And probably a large connector, actually. Freaking spot. There's the stupid connector. Need a lot of iron. See, here's the biggest problem. I don't even know if... I gotta see. Is my ship a small grid or a large grid? I think it's small. But I think... Can a small connector connect to a large connector? I don't even remember. Sit in a stupid seat and info. So I don't know how to tell if this stupid ship is small or large. There's no way to tell, I don't think. I 
probably will. If I go this stupid device. Yeah, so I gotta go to a connector. So this should tell me. I gotta figure out. So 15 steel plates and 12 construction. Let's. Now 15 and 12. So if I go to. Tells me what's required. Damn it. Alright, I'm looking on the wiki. Stupid shit. Okay, let's go to blocks. And we want connector. So a small connector is 15 and 12, so it's definitely a small connector, so I want to... See, that's a problem on the, sh on the station. You gotta be able to connect a small connector to a large ship station. I think. I have to be able to. still can't. Some people saying yes, some people saying no. <sighs> Almost positive that you cannot connect a small about this build a small one and uh, that's going to tell us yes or no I guess 
So, to build a small connector, we can test this with the drone ship, I guess. Need a bit of silicon. Nickel we should have. Oh wait, shit, I don't think we have nickel. Okay, so first things first. Let's let's destroy up some. Let's Oops, where did that go? Kill 20 of those and see what happens. Okay, we're getting silicon out of that. Probably we needed one point something, was it? One point two. So stop that. Why did it pull 72 over there? Okay, so we got our silicon that we need if we want to build this sucker. Now we need to find nickel. This is oxygen tank. Okay, we need to find some nickel here. Nickels in a detector component. I don't think we have any of that. Okay, we got some nickel in the metal grids. Five nickel in the metal grids. So, we need how much nickel here? 30. So we need six metal grids to disassemble. Piece of cake. We only got two of them. Shit. Reactor components. No, back to the drawing board. Uh, where's my reactor components? Let's throw out the thruster. Here we go. It doesn't use any nickel. Great. Nickel in medical components, which I doubt we have. Oh, we got a bunch of ammunition, but it requires very little. Uh, here we go, in motors. So we need six motors. Okay, we got enough motors. Let's, uh, let's do six. Oops. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Uh, how did these get pulled here? Okay, we got 30 nickel. We got more silicon than we wanted, but... Alright, we should definitely be able to... Oh, that's why. Yeah, yeah, let's put that back in the assembler. 
Let's put all this shit in the assembler. No, this, that's already in the assembler. Ship assembler. Production. There we go. Now we can build a connector. Just rebuilding computers, motors, which we broke down. Okay, whatever. We'll just, we'll just grab everything coming out of the assembler. I don't need this stuff for now. Probably don't need a hand drill either. Let's go build a connector out there. Is that the wrong way? Yeah. So we're gonna build a connector in the middle of nowhere, and because this will just be a test, really. Six, we're gonna build it I don't want it I want it uh hello is that right you know what for the test I don't think it's gonna matter much I want it pointing up there we go you know what let's just build it on top for now or, yeah, let's just build it on top for now. It's purely a test. Just make it easy to dock. Hold up, see, it's a large connector. Son of a bitch. Okay, you know what? We'll have enough components. We got steel plates. We got all this shit, probably. So let's... Let's just build this shit. Usual space engineers learning crap and building the wrong stuff all the time. Ah, uh, spare components. I forget what I needed, but probably one of all this shit. steel plate we only need 13 more construction components piles of steel plates Construction components. Eight construction, four computers. The rest are steel plates. Did I say eight construction, four computers? Eight 
Eight construction. Four computers. And the rest steel. Let's get rid of this and this. What's our oxygen level? Oxygen, hyd ooh, hydrogen's a little low. Gotta be careful about that. Considering I didn't take the hydrogen bottle with me. All right, we got the sucker built. So, let's see if it's on the grid. It is. Okay, time to grab the small rover. Although, let's uh, grab our equipment, what we had. Get rid of this. And where's my bottle? I think it was in the assembler. Actually, all my shit better grab now. Okay, furnace is still converting cobalt. All right. Let's see, let's get the rover roving. Gotta be careful I don't destroy this rover. Actually, we're gonna save at this point just to make sure. Okay. I think I have got the antenna off. Rover antenna, no, it's on. Why can I not control this thing? Okay, unlock and, oh, I do not have thrusters, thrusters on, uh oh, ah, the battery, yeah, that's what it is. Okay, our rover's away. Gotta be careful with this sucker, cause... Let's go to the camera view. What I need to do is add a camera to the back of this thing at some point. Oh, gotta be very careful on the speed, it's not easy to slow this sucker down. And I'm missing a thruster on one of the sides, cause I had to break it down to fix some things up. So we'll get it sort of in place, and then we will zoom over there so we can guide it in. And this is where if I was playing this with Oculus, I can actually tell. See, I've got zero perspective on whether this, how far back this thing is. In Oculus, I could, I'd be able to tell exactly where this sucker is. Well, it's pretty well lined up, but see, I thought it was a lot closer than this. But even here, this is, see, it looks like I'm not lined up this here we go okay we're locked in okay well we could we could dock here now the question is can we are we able to charge battery from here let's see rover battery recharge yep we are grabbing from this battery, there should be output of 16 point something. Hmm, no output. 
Oh, you know why? We're grabbing directly from the... Ah, yes. We are grabbing... Ah, power working much better in this version. Use This used to be really shitty, the power management. So right now, this battery is still charging because the solar panel on this grid is outputting outputting 79. So 45 is being siphoned into this battery and our rover battery is taking the other part of the input. Nice. That is good. So that way we're not before we would just drain this battery down, I think. Or there's a lot of strange shit that goes on with power. But this is working well enough for me. So we definitely need either more, well, we certainly need more, more solar panels. Because we need to be collecting a lot more energy here. This one's operating. Where the hell's the sun? That's the other thing. We may need to angle them a little bit differently. I'm surprised this is not getting a full charge. Pretty much. I guess probably just because of the slight angle of the sun. Son of a bitch. Okay, so this proves we can dock the small ship to this large grid, which makes sense. which means we should rebuild this platform. What's this hole over here? This is interesting. Interesting. I don't think I caused that hole before. Doesn't matter. Okay, so. Um... Yeah. So let's fix this platform. We'll let that charge for now. Or you know what? No sense. Let's remove the rover here. Rover battery. So you don't like that. Look at this. See, just because... Just because this rover is plugged in here, the battery on the station is sucking power from this rover, which I don't want it to do. So anyway, we're going to disconnect this sucker. Let's just get this sucker. Ah, let's just put it here for now. What I should do is shut it down though, I think. So its battery is not getting run down. Let's kill the thrusters. Okay, can I store my crap in here while I do some work? Let's see. I don't want this, this. No, I can't store in here. No, I can't store this shit here.
hate when... Oh, I don't like it when anywhere. What? Can't throw this to the seat. Alright. Let's... Put it here. Oh, I may need to drill. Ah, son of a bitch. This is gonna be painful. Let's get rid of these for now. They take up a lot of space. So we need to drill this sucker away. But you know what? I don't want to... If I fill my own inventory, these pieces are going to drop all over the place. So... I start building one here? Probably. I think I could just build it like that. That's the ticket, actually. So this is the way to do it. Semi, break it down. Semi, build it. This way, I don't have to go back and forth to cargo container, or worry about dropping pieces all over the place. ship should be able to dock here. Oh, did I give myself enough room with this rover sitting here? Uh, let's get the rover. You know what? Well, let's dock the huge ship first. So let's get this rover even further out of the way. Uh, batteries on. Antenna is good. Thrusters on. Just gonna move it straight up. Gotta remember, relax on the thrust. What the hell was that sound? Hmm. Alright, let's leave it powered on for now. Hell with it. Oops, where the hell's my ship? Okay, we haven't flown the ship since we landed here. So this should be interesting. Why is my oxygen so low? off too soon. Lost seven health there. Ah, I don't have an oxygen bottle with me. That was dangerous. Let's grab that back. What? Let's refill that bottle. Throw it there, back here. Alright, so we're going to have to fly the ship up there and dock the sucker. This ship has a kind of a cool computer system here. So I can go into the ship status here, or can I? Navigation. So thruster control. Okay, we're gonna...
turn on all thrusters. Actually, before we do any of this, good old save again. So, toggle all thrusters on. Turn the assembler off. I'm not sure whether the boarding ramp. Ah, still for travel. We may have to do this. I'm not 100% sure. Okay, it's stowed. Um, I think we just need to we just need to unlock our landing gear. thrusters on the top of this thing, do we? Okay, we gotta be really careful here. Why does the rover... I thought the rover was like right near the rock up there. Okay, we're gonna go to external view even though I don't like playing in third person whatsoever, but... Without someone helping you to guide you into these landing pads and such. I wonder if I built this. You know what? I don't like I have thrusters on the top of this thing. So, oh, we do have thrusters on the side. Are they? They are pointing up. So we can't go up, right? Yeah, very little down thrust. Okay, so that's just the way this sucker is designed. Wait a minute. Can I not thrust down at all? Should be able to. Hmm. There's thrusters there to allow me to do that, I think. Are they on a different grid? I think they're on a different grid. I think that's... is that why? How the hell am I gonna do this then? Well, oh, easy, easy, easy. Okay, we'll thrust this way. Getting zero down thrust. Great. Ah, so we'll have to angle ourselves down and kind of oh, this mouse control is not useful. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Has a lot of upward thrust. This is going to be disastrous. No idea how I'm going to. Uh... Oh, you know what? My landing gear. Landing gear is at the back, so I'm going to have to actually swing this sucker around. Let's see if we have enough room. Now let's move 
it out. Should probably ease up on the gyroscope. Uh, yeah, the gyroscope is way too sensitive if you ask me. Let's let's put this sucker at fifty percent power. If that let's go to twenty five actually or so. Might still be too much. Hard to tell. Okay, now now we'll slope it down a bit. Okay, looks like we're lined up. And bring it back. Not entirely lined up. And we need to slope down even more. We just gotta keep keep doing this. Major pain in the ass trying to dock this piece of shit. But I think if we keep doing this shit, I don't think we have enough room to dock this sucker whatsoever. Definitely not. That's okay, what we'll have to do is, yeah, let's build out, all right, that's fine. Let's, I guess. Yeah, okay, thruster control. Ooh, steering control. Let me check that in. Check that out. Full control of gyroscope. Hmm. I don't know how you change that. Okay, thruster control. Let's turn them all off. Just to save fuel, because look at that, we're down to 46 fuel. That took a lot of fuel. Son of a bitch. Okay, what do we need out here? gonna extend so we need some steel plates minimum let's just grab a minimum amount maybe construction not sure all right so get our helmet ready stupid ramp. Can I get out of here with the ramp like this? So I don't feel like playing around with the ramp. There we go. So this will give us a good idea. We've got to build the this sucker out here somewhere. This what going to do for now let's just do this so if we build it here that should give us enough room to land I'm guessing let's go one further out just to give us some room behind ok 
pretty sweet. Let's go a couple out. And now we'll build the sucker here. Why is it not letting me do it? This one down. Shit. Already filled up my. Should have done this first. Hmm. Ah, it's because of the stupid bottles taking up a lot of space. Well, let's get rid of these bottles. Out, I need the drill. I do need both of these. Okay, let's slap in some more plate, uh, steel here. Might be good enough for now, at least the landing gear are gonna touch down and everything. Good enough. Actually, let's go heal ourselves up a bit. Our nice medical facility. Good enough. Oh yeah, we gotta slip in sideways here, I think. Toggle throttle uh, thrusters on off. External view. And I think we can now pitch down too far and come forward. See, I don't know how the hell I'm going to make the landing. What? We gotta go past a little. Pretty much get even. Get the landing gear even with the structure, then reverse. So probably like like this. Then we could slide back. see if we're gonna hit the dam gotta be over to the right a smidgen oops I didn't want to rotate I wanted to thrust right I 
think we're lined right up. Yeah, this ship is shitty for maneuvering. Ah, shit, we're going up, which we don't want to be doing. There we go. And I think when we're right over top, I can probably hit the... There we go, perfect. Landing gear, lock in, connector is disabled. Why? Why, why, why is the connector disabled? Let's check connectors. Connector power adapter. No idea what this is. I think that is... Okay, let's... I think the ticket is 0 0.015. No, 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 not that high. Said point zero one point zero zero one five maybe. Fuck. Okay, why are the connectors disabled? Okay, we're locked in now. We are locked in. Thrusters. Off. Now, let's see if... Okay, our batteries are charging. Now, wait a minute. Is that the shuttle controlling? Why are we controlling the shuttle? Oh no, this is the shuttle. So our batteries are recharging. I thought we had more than one battery in this thing. What the fuck is this? That's the battery on the station. This is the battery here. Let's recharge this sucker. Okay, that's beautiful. It's recharging. Recharge. Recharge. Yeah, see, this is a bullshit. I can't use one of these batteries to run the refinery while these two recharge. If I let this one discharge, it's going to actually charge these two batteries. So it's, you should say, don't let a battery recharge another battery. Uh, well, you should, but only in certain circumstances. Anyhow, I think we are recharging and that's why everything's... Yeah, let's shut down the arc furnace for now. There we go. Ooh, this probably means... What just happened? We got no gravity, but at least our oxygen is still happening here. That's okay. That's a relief. Uh oh, we've got. Oh yeah, that's why I'm walking weird. My grav boots are taking. We've got two enemy signals. That's not good. So the next thing to do would be building out more um, definitely building out more solar panels I 
I believe. And keeping an eye on those enemies. Let's save once again. So let's probably go build a... Oh shit, you're telling me I can't even get into this storage because of the power usage? I can't get out of here either. Or can I? Nope. Ah. See, that's kind of the bullshit thing about this. There should be enough power, or I suppose there's not enough power to... Yeah, so I, I'm... Why is a factory trying to take power? Do we have the assembler still running? It's off. The arc furnace is off. This is the other thing. It's hard to figure out what's needing power here. But that negative 286 there coming up for factory should not come up. Um, okay, doors, yeah, it needs some power. Uh, utility needs some power. Reactors. I guess that's my batteries. Why are they draining? I don't have reactors other than batteries. So I don't know what this 58 kilowatts is required on anything. Maybe we should not recharge. Okay, so if I remove the recharge here, see it's outputting 4.32 megawatts somewhere, probably to charge these batteries. Yeah, which is stupid. So what I would, you would want a button that says do not discharge, but you can't have that. So what we're going to do is not recharge anything right now. And unfortunately now they're charging this fucking battery. Fuck. Ah, so let's... Turn the recharging off on that battery. But then it won't recharge, for fuck's sakes. So... So we should be drawing power from the solar panel, which we're probably not. Yeah, again, once again, all of this shit is nonsense. So let's see now. Okay, so if we recharge fully and let this sucker discharge. Okay, so our ship... Ah, okay, this is a better method. And I assume we're pulling power from the solar panel as well. At least you would think. That's fully depleted in six minutes, so these things will not get fully charged. Now let's see what happens in six minutes. In six minutes, we should at least still be charging up from the solar. Okay, so everything on the ship at least should be running. And now we can go build up. What the fuck? Why can't I get in into this now? Everything fucking shut down? Why the fuck can't I get into cargo container? Oh, that's the assembler and... This is a cargo container. Why the fuck can't I get in here? Weird. Okay, hopefully I can do everything through here. Uh, solar. 
Let's grab this. One of these. Well, let me grab that. All of those. And as I can't grab any solar because he's won't let me grab them through the... Okay, I'll grab them from outside. And let's get rid of this. Actually, let's put it in the connector. I can always grab it from outside. And I can't. Alright, get the helmet ready. Can I not operate the doors? Hello. You know what? Even though something messed up here. So we're not out of power here. Did I lock up the doors or something? Last time I was in here. Fuck. Something's fucked up with the power here. Oh, wait a minute. All our batteries are on charging fully, that's why. Okay, so everything's going through recharging. Alright, we're going to have to wait it out. Three minutes. So once that's depleted, what we're going to do is disconnect from the dam uh, connector. Because if I turn this on to recharge, actually let's do, let's do this, I think that will get it to recharge once it's We're going to say that these are charged up enough until we have enough battery stored in this battery. This is not worth doing. Or until we have more batteries, more solar panels, all that kind of shit. For now though, this will keep me alive. a solar panel looking like yeah it's barely barely pulling in any power all right we're ready here soon son of a bitch
Okay, so that's... Okay, so yeah, it's already recharging from my batteries, which I did not want it to do. Okay, so it's fully discharged. These guys... Where's it getting its input from? Ah, probably from the solar panel. So, here's a problem. I can't even... Let's turn this fucking battery off for a second. There we go. Now, these three guys, I can do this. And my ship can disconnect from this freaking thing. Except I've lost my panel up there. Okay, let's forget about that for now. We need our thrusters on, or can we just... Yeah, we need our thrusters on. Great. Well, hold out that panel on. Call these computer display center, probably. What it probably is is a timer block that is not being triggered anymore. Or a programming block. Timer. Not sure what all these do, but we're gonna fire them all off. Fuck. Wonder what this is. This fucking thing is not running. So, alright, forget that. Thrusters. We'll make a group and. Uh, which ones are these? assume these are all on this ship. Have to be. Uh, shuttle thrusters. Okay. Oops. Okay, shuttle thrusters on. to unlock and move forward and if we relock landing gear is locked all right thrusters off uh, batteries batteries primary Okay, so all these suckers are golden. We're not using a lot of power, supposedly. And now... I still can't get in this fucking cargo container. How is that? 
How can that be? Everything's... How the fuck? And the assembler, too. Okay, the assembler's off, but I don't think you could turn off the cargo containers. What the fuck? Why can I not get in these fucking cargo container? The doors better work. Fuck! So we fucked up this whole ship just because I turned off just because the power went dead. Look at this. Okay. Archive server. Do not modify. What the fuck? How can doors not be working? Sliding door interior. Ah, so messed up. So this kind of shit is definitely... It's got to be bugged, right? Unless this is made to, unless a stupid mission is made to do that. But what would be blocking the doors from being used? See, not even getting a, the assembler is most likely mine, is it not? Everything's owned. switching these maybe it will do something so I don't know now I gotta go back to some fucking save that I had because I can't get out of my ship oh wait a minute see now now at least that display is back but none of these controls are working So I probably messed up something, maybe, by triggering these timer blocks. Timer block JB. Thing is, there's no actions in here, so... What the fuck? So even triggering... I know when I triggered it, it... There were some actions in here. Or there were no actions in here, so how can it do anything? Oh, this might be why I can't open the doors, because of the airlock. Okay, so let's... Okay, this might allow me to get out of this fucking ship. Ah, that turned green, I think, up there. Finally! Get our helmet ready. Alright. So let's... We'll go with a sort of half-ass functioning ship. And all after all this, I forget why I came out... Okay, I came out here to get this battery charging. And to probably build more solar panels. We've lost probably full sun. Yep. Where's our sun? Hello. Okay, let's check the shadows. Should be over to the right somewhere. There it is. So let's just get a tip of the 
We should probably just build straight out here, probably. Right off the edge. Right off the end, perhaps. Okay, I need steel plates. Mass suspected. build some at a different angle but for now maybe that won't matter let's just build off the end here where's the indicator okay so that's how I want them I think okay let's go with two for now because we probably won't have enough to... It's a solar cells that we're going to be carrying back and forth like a son of a bitch. Hey, Darfin. Welcome. Oh, you think I should uh, strengthen it with some with some blocks? I've never done that before. Damn it! Oh yeah, I've done something like that before, like, uh, I think you mean up the middle, right? Put solar panels on either side. I mean, as long as nothing runs into this, these things, it should be fine. apologize if I don't respond to your chat right away half the time this twitch chat is is really crappy it disconnects and reconnects all the time so one construction component and then basically solar cells and mostly all solar cells here solar cells now. And I don't need this. Oops.
think that will finish up this one. Yep. Not that it matters much. Or maybe it is. Oh, that one's much more in the sun. Only still only getting two off that. Next thing to build is a bloody uh, welder rover, but that takes some time. It'll probably be difficult to build given the resources I have. Actually, no, I need a uh, refinery, regular refinery, over anything else. Which reminds me. Fire up my arc furnace. Get that thing back going. This might be the last trip here. Oops. my oxygen and everything doing. Not bad. Alright. That should help with the battery situation. Maybe. Yeah, at least we're getting 155. Solar panel are starting to bring in more power. I guess I should really just keep building them out. Question is... Do I build up this way, or just keep building out? Uh, what I could do is... Maybe that's what... Diaphan is talking. I can actually... If I build some steel blocks along here, I can actually disassemble this one and build it further out. Ah, that's for later. I can also uh, grind down a lot of this rock here and hope that the sun is in the right rotation to keep hitting these solar panels. I messed up. I messed up the ship somehow. That that panel in the middle is all messed up. Oh, you know what? Let's try this. The other seats have. Just thought of something. Uh, you know what? I haven't required this gun whatsoever, so we're gonna leave that. always like to have some steel on me, just in case we're going to build anything. And why is my furnace not doing anything now? Oh, it is. Couldn't hear it going, so... middle panel. Let's let's get into one of these seats because I think that panel's supposed to come down. See I messed up. He just I think you just cannot let the power die on the ship. Which is a, a lame ass thing in space engineers. Things do not fire up properly again. Yeah, so I'd have to mess around enough to figure out how to get the panels up and going and again I think this is just a bug 
like not being able to get into this assembler from here is definitely something I've never seen before. That's a major problem. So now I gotta sit in one of these stupid seats just to play around with my assembler. Let's turn it on for a second. Maybe that's the ticket. No, see, I still can't access it from here. That's just messed up. Uh, da 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 da. we need back. Connector, power adapter. Shit. See, I should be able to grab those from inside here, but I can't. Or maybe I can from one of these. Nope. Son of a bitch. Connector power adapter, I believe, is the one in the middle. Can I get to it? Come on. Fuck. I do not want to grind away one of these blocks. to it, but I guess I am. Yeah, it's true, Dire Fan. I probably don't need that ramp. It's probably a good thing to uh, grind down. There's probably a lot of junk on this ship that I could technically grind down. Um, I'm just worried about this ramp and rotors on it. I don't want to demolish anything. Are you familiar with this uh, scenario? I should grind down this ramp, really. Give me some steel plates, the rotors, I might get be able to get some decent stuff out of. That's a good idea, actually, because this ramp's pretty much just useless and a pain in the ass. All right, let's, what the hell, let's do that. We'll do a save just because even though I'm kind of pissed I didn't uh, I should have renamed some of my saves so I can go back to a point where the ship wasn't messed up but we're gonna live with it for now Is that floating around? That's what I was worried about. Is this buggy? 
Shit. Let's see, this block kind of just grinded down the door a bit by accident. <sighs> Shit. Be able to store these here. Uh, whatever. I do want to get rid of them though. Put them in the spare parts for now. As long as I have enough oxygen and hydrogen, yeah, I do. something a little buggy here as you can tell see that piece is just floating away and I can't can't even select the freaking thing grind from in here in case that way pieces will go floating out that way hopefully this might take a while to grind down because they're blast doors gotta be careful here I think is this detached Oh, what the hell is attached to what? I don't think these things are attached to anything at the moment. So I'm surprised they're not falling away. Yeah, definitely some issues here with being able to select these blocks. Exactly in the right spot here. Probably grind that off too. See, look at that. Keep selecting the block underneath, which can be dangerous. You might grind down something you don't intend to grind down.
fuck is this steel plate just sitting there? Oh, because my inventory's full. I wasn't watching that now. We don't want loose shit just floating around here. So be attached there. This is the connection to the larger, to one of the rotors, so let's leave that. We will grind down here. What's interesting is I think this ship is connected by those connectors. I guess I think because these are these pods are meant to be dropped, maybe to provide uh, oxygen somewhere else. I don't know. Or maybe they have to be connected by connector to in order to. Yeah, I suppose they do have to be connected by a connector in order to supply the oxygen into the ship. What is that? A battery there? How the hell is that connected? It's some weird connector there. The reason I, you know, 
exit when you look in the control panel this seems like a separate grid down here could be attached though hard to tell there is a space there so although that's got to be attached to I don't know either way we're not playing around with that I don't think here so we got button panel that's probably a massive rotor in there could probably grind all of that down definitely I mean it's not needed for anything else I don't think at least gives us a couple computers, interior plate. That's a rotor there, which we're not going to need either. Let's uh, dump these components off. Energy, oxygen, 50%. heavy though so we gotta be careful that we don't fill up inventory shit what's this piece steel catwalk okay shit inventory's full it's all right let those suckers float a bit Gave us some nice resources there. Is this another one floating here? A lot of good components in here. Sort of. All right. throw a block in here just to cover up some of this crap here ah who cares well, that 
let's grab this and where did my oxygen bottle go might as well fill it no it's gotta go in the tank uh oh and why is it not filling now not look like it's charging. Are we totally in the dark? Ew. What's going on here? Oh, it's charging. Just not showing any lights on it yet. Mm, that's strange. I'm thinking we got a bunch of bugs happening here. are overdoing on power. Ah, it can survive for a while. All right, we got a clear back section here. steel plates Ooh, more than that I could always just leave it like that at least it's semi-protected so I need uh, 23 extra anyhow. And I know it doesn't match that side, but who cares? And in fact, we could grind down those catwalks and replace with a steel plate because that just looks kind of cooler, but we're not going for looks right now. We are going for... Let's do that. Oh, that's a light armor block. Oh, did we just got it covered by one of these? Looks like it. Yeah, that's just a cover. We don't need this shit. for a cover to make things look nice. There we go. Solar panels working at full power. That's what I like to see. We're getting the full sun right now. But they 
these batteries take a lot to get. Charged up, that's for sure. All right, let's get back in the ship for a second here. Guess we'll save and actually I'll be back in a few minutes. Oh, you can see right now. So you're going to fall, you're going to die, and then you're going to start fire.
All right, I'm back, but I think I'm gonna call this a session done, at least for space engineers. I may flip over to something else and I may or may not stream. I guess we will see. Oops, let's exit, save. And I always make a copy of my last save, even though I think Spatial Engineers does something in these backup directory, but I don't trust it. And thanks for tuning in. Until next time, we'll see you guys.